penalty uh, that was given. We've seen a few angles. It looked like Scott Wharton got a push in the back. What was your take on it? I think the difficult thing, and I, and I don't need to be uh, evasive, is I don't really want to talk about the the penalty ascending off the officials because I think it can detract them from um, some of the good things we've done tonight. Uh, and again, I think the important thing is, yeah, we'll let the dust settle. Uh, we'll review it. But the one thing I've learned from the, the amount of games that I've had as a, as a manager, as a, as a coach, is no matter what I say now, the, I can't change the result. Um, so again, that's, I think the important thing for us now is to focus on the performance individually and collectively. Still, still areas that we can improve on, uh, but we're still on that upward curve. I understand where you're coming from. Um, your side showed a lot of resilience out here tonight. Just one on the red card. Uh, it seems to be that it's it's pretty clear cut. It probably was a red card. There was an incident in the second half where, right in front of you, right in front of the full official, Wharton got. It looked like two hands from the face. Uh, what was your what was your thinking on that one? The, 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 again, I'm, I'm, I'm going to I'm going to sound evasive, but I don't want tonight's point gained to be about referees decisions. Um, uh, or anything like that. We put in a good performance away from home. We've gained, uh, we've gained a point. Uh, we showed some ball- some battling qualities. We showed some good play. We, sh- uh, we caused them some problems with the football. Slightly disappointing that we didn't go in at half time with, with a, be- a better goal advantage because I thought we uh, pl- played some played some good football. The areas that we need to work on in the second half away from home when you know teams are kind of come out. Uh, ball retention, forward forward play ca- can be better. Uh, our defensive line of retention. Can, can be higher. Uh, so there's lots of things that, that technically that we can work on, and I think it's important that it was a point earned and gained uh, today, um, and yeah, lessons, lessons to be learned as well. Yeah, you're, you're under the cosh at the end, as you'd expect. You're the away side, the, the home side had the, the tails of the crowd behind them as well, but you, you showed great resilience to a man, everyone fighting to keep the ball out of the net, and Di Cornell coming up with some big saves as well. Yeah, a, and again, that's something that's, uh, that's growing at this, uh, at this football club, and it's a culture that we're trying to instill in, uh, in, the, in the players. Uh, there's a challenge to be had, and uh, we're prepared to put ourselves on the line for it, which means that whether that's a block, uh, whether that's a tackle, whether that's a header to, uh, header to be won, uh, we will be competitive and we will compete. And, uh, and that is growing uh, and it's spreading uh, more and more throughout the football club. And, that, and, and that's good. Uh, uh, things happen. Sometimes you get, a, you get a knock on the chin, but we get back up. And a point earned tonight, which, and it means, I suppose it, it doesn't mean too much, but it means you can sit, still say the line, you're unbeaten so far in, in 2020, which... It has a nice ring to it. Yeah, again, I think there's going to be 18, 19 games to go. There's going to be twists and turns. There's going to be challenges that the players are going to face, whether that's team selection, whether that's uh, peer peers in games. Um, but I've got to say, the changing room, the culture that we're creating at the football club, we accept the challenges. Look ahead to Friday then. Um, we'll deal with the one negative, which is you won't have Scott Wharton. How much of a blow would that be for you? Well, again, it will be a challenge. Uh, it will be a challenge, but now we've got two days now to work, um, whether it's a change of shape, whether it's a change of personnel. But again, uh, we will be competitive on Friday. Uh, and we will be on the front foot and we will, and we, we will identify the, the areas that we think that we can cause some problems and we need to uh, identify the areas where we need to nullify their threats. Uh, again, we're playing against a championship team, a very good championship football club that have got some very very good players um, and so we will need to be on our best uh, and again we won't uh, we won't go into the game on the back foot uh, we will take the game out it's a cup tie and uh, strange things happen in cup ties 